Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Green Mountain Kettle Corn. This is the original kettle corn. I have the make. These were sent to us from Alicia, so thank you very, very much to Alicia for sending us these. Uh, Alicia went to Vermont and saw this and thought, Kevin and Tammy haven't tried these, so she had them mailed to us. We greatly appreciate it. Uh, Gluten-free, uh, GMO-free, corn, dairy-free, soy-free, no preservatives, nut-free, made in Vermont, award-winning. We ship, it says. Uh, we'll talk about that at the end of the video. Uh, handcrafted in small batches, GreenMountainKettleCorn.com. Now, there are no calories on these bags, at least. So, I don't know if you, you would be able to find that on their website or not. They may, probably not. Um, if it's a smaller, company, smaller so companies, don't. don't have to. Well, I don't know if they don't have to, they don't. <laughs> they, they are, they, well, I know as far as bakeries, they do not have to. By law, they don't, if, if they only sell so much or I guess make so much or whatever, they don't have to. Mmm. That's a nice kettle corn. That reminds you of the kettle corn you would get at like a festival. Well, like if if we have a we have a little local festival called the Pioneer Festival, and they always have the big uh, copper kettle making you know caramel corn with the with the ore. <laughs> it's funny it, you say that. It tastes just like that. Because on their website they have pictures of that. Yeah. They they do a it's lot exactly of festivals. Right. That's exactly what that tastes mm -hmm. like. They do a lot of festivals. It's good. It, how is it different than regular? popcorn it is sweeter mm. it, it has like a little sugary crust on it but it's not really thick and it's not covering necessarily the whole thing right but it is it's definitely um much much sweeter mm -hmm. yep yeah, it's got a little saltiness to it mostly sweet though uh which i like yeah i don't have an issue with. this is the maple i like the kind of popcorn they use too it's that big fat popcorn Looks like a brain. So, so yeah, it says the same. It says ingredients: corn, corn oil, maple, sugar, and salt. Mm -hmm. That's it. When I eat popcorn, I don't grab just one piece. Mm -hmm. It's at least two. Like I said, I really like that they use the this fat popcorn. There are some holes in there, definitely the skin. Mm hmm That is so good. It's good, but it almost has a like a scorched flavor. I like it. I don't like it as much. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, I do. In fairness, though, Tammy used to love the burnt pieces in microwave popcorn. Yeah, I do. I eat the burnt pieces. Um, that kind of has a scorched flavor to it. Now, that could have been just that batch happened to do that. Um, I don't get maple at all, though. Um, it doesn't, honestly, it doesn't taste like maple to me. Um, it just tastes like a different version of sweet. Yeah, it's just got, well, it tastes like the sugar has been scorched. It's burnt, burnt sugar instead of regular sugar. I like scorched sugar. Yeah, I, I like the regular, um, I like the regular better. And I love that. I could literally, well, you see me eating it. I could sit here and eat the entire bag. So, um, the, that entire bag is probably 600 calories or something. But I could eat it all. I think that is absolutely delicious. Yeah, it's not as sweet as like caramel corn. And it's not as hard as caramel corn either. I love the smell of it. I love the flavor of it. And it's hard for me to believe that, that you... Mm, it's, oh my it gosh. It smells like sports sugar. I think it... Oh, it's it's wonderful. It's, it's Now, it has so a little good. bit of a sugary maple kind of smell, but it doesn't taste like it. I'm not getting maple at all. No. It just... It, it, that's fine. It's sugar. Call it scorched if you want, but it's delicious. It's I love this. I would eat the whole. You can life. even see the scorched pieces on the on the popcorn itself. Well, I think it's perfect. I don't think they should change a thing. Uh, when I went to the website, though, they did show pictures of like from festivals and stuff. But get this. Uh, well, well, I'll tell you about prices in a minute. I want you to hear the flavors they offer because this is. I mean, they offer some really cool flavors. They have ranch. Hmm. Dill pickle, queso dip, French toast, hello, honey mustard, sour cream and onion, birthday cake, cheddar blast, white cheddar, buffalo breath, which I like the name of that, buffalo wing, and caramel. 
so, I mean, they have a lot to choose from. When you go uh, to the website, these bags are $6.49 each. If you spend <coughs> over $30, you get free shipping, which I think is a heck of a deal. Um, because with most companies, it's more than $30 you have to spend. Um, a four pack, you can choose four flavors and it's $23. If you choose, if you go with an eight pack, it's $44. So you could get, get spend, eight and get free shipping. And get free shipping. You could get, go get eight different flavors of your choice, spend $44 and it's going to ship to your house free. I think that's a pretty good deal myself. Yeah. I mean, if you want popcorn, if it is a little popcorn. expensive for bags of popcorn, but but I, I, I can like understand why that would be too expensive for some people. But if you if you oh, can afford it, of then, course. But yeah, yeah, if you could afford it and you want to try something, some cool new flavors, yeah. I think this would be fun to try. It's good quality popcorn. It seems very fresh. It's very crunchy. It's not. Sometimes when you get these popcorns, they're kind of squishy and soft, like they're almost stale. These are not. They're very crunchy and, mm -hmm. and crispy. Yeah, I, I think this is absolutely delicious. Yeah. Uh, so but, I think it's good. I just think that one, that's just not my kind of flavor. Not but, his kind of flavor. But, but Alicia, thank you so much for thinking of us uh, when you went to Vermont. We greatly appreciate it. I hope everyone else enjoyed the video. If you've ever had this popcorn, let us know. If you've seen this, you're like, they go to all the festivals in my area. You'll have to let us know what, uh, what flavor did you try. Mm -hmm. So I hope you enjoyed it and thanks for watching. <music>